so much for joining me today. I'm going to go ahead and share a fun video today. It is a tag video and it is the I Heart Fall tag. So I want to go ahead and take this opportunity to thank Breeze and Clean. Breeze with me and clean. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and leave her channel listed down below so you guys can check out her video. Um, and she went ahead and tagged me, so I wanted to go ahead and do this for you guys. Plus, I love fall, so that didn't hurt either. Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get right into the questions and give you my answers. I will go ahead and also list the questions down below in case you want to do the tag so that you can go ahead and do so. So let's get right into it. All right. So the first question is, what is your fall? What's your favorite fall scent? Um, my favorite fall scent will have to be anything pumpkin spice or cupcake pum pumpkin or anything that's pumpkin related because it's just shouting fall. Um, I love, love, love fall and pumpkin sweet smells are so yummy and delicious and I have to say that I'm kind of generic like that. <laughs> because I love pumpkins so, so much. So yeah, anything pumpkin scented. All right, next question. Best way to spend a rainy day? You guys, this one is super easy for me because um, if I have the day off and it's a rainy, gloomy day, my favorite thing to do is throw on comfy jammies, get a comfy throw blanket, wrap myself in it, sit on the couch and just lounge and watch movies. I love watching movies. I love watching shows. That's kind of the thing that my husband and I do anyway. And so I really, really enjoy it. There's no need to go outside or to do anything. Just chill and watch shows and or movies. And in case you're curious or want to know, um, one of my, well, two of my favorite fall movies would have to be number one, Practical Magic. Um, if you haven't seen it, you guys need to check it out. Sandra Bullock and Nicole Kidman are amazing in that movie. Um, honestly, I love the ants. I love everything. Um, the characters are amazing. The music is so good. And um, I just, I love everything about that show. It's just oh, heart and fuzzy and warm and I just love it. And that's what I would be watching. Um, and if it's not that one, it's my other favorite movie, which is Hocus Pocus. Um, I absolutely love Hocus Pocus. It's a ritual, you guys. Those two movies are a must in October. There's just no ifs, ands, or buts about it. So if you haven't seen them, um, you're missing out. Check them out. <laughs> All right, next question is, um, favorite fall drink? So I would have to say it's apple cider. Um, even though I love the pumpkin spice lattes, I love the pumpkin chocolate ones, um, they're not my favorite. I do like them. I, As a matter of fact, I would say I love them even, but they're not my favorite. My favorite is apple cider. Oh, I love apple cider so, so much. Um, so yeah, that would be my fall favorite and I like it warm and I usually drink it in the fall. So I think that's why it's a fall favorite. So yeah. All right, guys, the next question is football, yay or nay? And I'm sorry to say that it's a nay. Um, I am not a sports fanatic. Um, football is honestly one that I don't even understand the concept. I've never really cared to learn it. My husband is a huge sports fan and he loves football. But you know what? I just, I never got into it. Um, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I just... Nah, it doesn't interest me. My son never played sports, so I just had no reason to love it, to be honest with you. Um, when my husband's watching sports, I'll usually be DIYing, crafting, um, decorating, cleaning. Like, I just have so many things that I love to do, and football is just not one of them. Sorry, guys. I know most of you love football, and it's a nay for me. Favorite article of clothing for the fall? Okay, so if it's clothing specific, it's going to have to be flannel. I love rocking my flannel during the fall. I have every color except for pink. I need a 
pink flannel. I need to find one. <laughs> if you guys have seen a pink flannel somewhere, let me girl, let your girl know. Let me know. I need, I need one. <laughs> but I love rocking flannel. I think flannel is just so, so wonderful. And I don't know what it is about it. I just, it's, it's just knowing that it's fall, I guess. I absolutely love it and I love wearing it. Now, if it doesn't have to be an article of clothing per se, it's boots. I would have to say boots are number one. I love all different types of boots, tall boots, short boots, um, booties. I love, I just love boots. I think boots are so fun in the fall and winter. Um, so yeah, fall boots and or the flannel. So that would have to be my answer. Okay, next up we have Haunted House, Haunted Hayride, or Haunted Corn Maze. Mm, I'm going to go with the Haunted House. I've never done the Hayride one, but I have done the Corn Maze. And the thing with the Corn Maze and it being haunted is that you're already lost because you don't know where you're going and then somebody's scaring you on top of that. Yeah, no. <laughs> and then when you do a haunted house, I mean, I'm a wuss, you guys. I'm scared. For somebody who's obsessed with Halloween, um, I'm pretty, pretty big scaredy cat. Um, so I like the haunted houses in the sense that I know I'm going to get scared, so I prepare for that. But it's still usually pretty darn scary. But yeah, if I had to choose between those three, that's my answer. Okay, let's see. Mm-hmm. <laughs> scariest movie you've ever seen okay you guys so this is kind of a funny story but i would have to say the original halloween um i remember in high school when we had like a free day or i don't remember why but a group of us decided that we were gonna watch halloween and oh my goodness, it scared the living pants at, off of me. Like literally, it was just the scariest thing ever. And uh, it was horrible. Um, and I don't know if it was my teen years or what, but that was pretty scary. Fast forward just a little bit, um, Candyman. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that from like the 90s. I think it was the 90s. Anyway, that's freaking scary. And it's, I didn't want to go into a bathroom by myself for years. <laughs> I know, I'm so crazy. But yeah, now that I'm older, I like scary movies. But what's funny is that they don't really scare me anymore. Now I just think they're kind of dumb and lame. Um, but. I was really scared way back when. I mean, I do still get scared. I think it's more of the suspense um, than the actual, you know. There's so many good scary movies, though. Anyway, okay, continuing. Um, favorite candy to eat on Halloween? Um, hands down, it is candy corn. So I have candy corn in little uh, candy dishes all over my house. I love candy corn. My husband and my son love candy corn. I have candy corn everywhere. But another fall favorite, if it's not just random fall candy, it's still fall, but oh my gosh, you guys, have you tried those apple caramel candies? The green ones with the caramel on it? Oh, stop. I can, oh, I can eat those like, like nothing. I mean, I love those. So it's either candy corn or those apple caramel candies, uh, sucker thingies. So, so good. Mm, okay. Now I want one of those. Um, what would you and your kids be this year? So you guys hear me out. I don't know what it is about this year. I haven't quite decided, but I normally know a full year in advance what I'm going to be for Halloween the upcoming year. And this year, I am kind of in a funk. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to be. I have no idea what my husband's going to be, and nor does my son. He's 18, and I, will, I want to remedy this um, for sure because let me tell you, my husband and I, um, have some cute costumes and I'm not just saying that but this year 
I just haven't been my usual self in planning. Um, I think a lot of it has to do with weight gain, um, not to get too, you know, uh, in here, but yeah, anyway. Uh, so I was, my husband and I had an amazing costume picked out last year for this year, but the costume doesn't fit me. So there's always the next year. <laughs> um, yeah, I have no idea what we're going to be. Sorry to disappoint you guys. And normally I would have an answer, especially by now, but I don't. Let's see if we can remedy that real soon though, because I will dress up. That is one thing my husband and I do every single year. He knows it's my favorite holiday. So he and I always dress up and my son too. My son's dressed up every year from birth. So yeah, anyway. Um, favorite fall recipe. Um, a favorite fall recipe would have to be the popcorn caramel balls. Oh, you guys, those are so good. And the homemade version where you can just pull the little ball apart and it's got the marshmallows and the caramel. Oh, it's so good. I love it. So yeah, the uh, popcorn caramel balls. Those are my favorite fall recipes. Okay. Um, what's my favorite thing about fall? I think I said it like a hundred thousand times already, but hands down Halloween. Um, there is nothing better than Halloween. I'm telling you guys, it's my favorite holiday. It's my favorite season because of the holiday. Um, I just think it's so fun to be someone different for a full day. Um, you know, and it's not that you're being someone different because you're you, but it's just, I just have so much fun getting into character. Like once I decide what I'm going to be, I'm that person full on and at my age, I still dress up. I think it's so cool when moms dress up with their kids, um, when they go trick or treating, I'll dress up. I think it's just the funnest. My son is older now and so he doesn't trick or treat anymore. But let me tell you, I love handing out candy. I love seeing all the kids in their costumes and I tell them how amazing they look and they get all giddy and happy that somebody's complimenting their costume. And that's me. I'm that mom. I'm the mom that's right there at the door every two seconds when the doorbell's ringing, handing out candy and loving it. And I'm dressed up as well. Okay, let's see. Uh, who else would you like to complete the I Heart Fall YouTube tag? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and definitely make this a open um, tag, but I will go ahead and name a few of the girls that I follow that I think would do a great job at completing this. Susie B, a mama of three girls. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do Hazel's World. Um, I'm going to go ahead and also do, let's see. Um, <laughs> Emily's Ideas. I think she would do great. Stephanie Simple Life. Um, I think um, Graham Life, if she hasn't already done it, you guys have done a horrible job about um, keeping up with my YouTube girls, I need to just have one day where all I do is watch, have a YouTube marathon. Um, I really, truly appreciate your support. Um, just to kind of give you a little bit of background, I just started a, at a new clinic and the hours are long. And so I'm trying to get adjusted to my new norm, but I'm still putting out two videos a week for you guys and I'm trying my hardest. So I truly, truly appreciate all of your love and support. It means the world to me. But I want to thank you so much for tuning in today. And I hope you've enjoyed today's video and gotten to know me just a little bit better. And I want to just hope and ask you guys to have a beautiful and blessed day. Bye, guys.